Hey Disco, what are you doing there? Changing some mother strings, man. You're such a nice guy helping out the bass player change strings. I am. He often helps me, so. That's I nice. Figure I could repay the favor like one out of a hundred times since he has <laughs> about a hundredth of my gear. That's right. All you bass players out there, all you bass players out there, help your drummers with their shit. And maybe vice versa will happen. Because it's a pain in the ass to carry around all those drums. We have it easy. All we gotta do is carry around a bass, you know, maybe a cab and whatever, but... Imagine if I was like Perk. Well, yeah. You would hate me. That's right, dude. <laughs> Remember that. Help the drummer. Help the drummers. What do you think about the recording so far? Recording's been great, you know. It's just solid two and a half days so far and um everything seems to be going pretty smoothly and uh it's gonna be a fun record <laughs> that was more even that was the hardest part of the night right there yeah that was the hardest part of the night that was the hardest bass drumming i've done to date I just kind of stuck it in there. That's what she said. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Come on, Sam, give the ladies a little something there. Don't hate them. I've heard the least the least once today. <laughs> What's up? What's your name, buddy? Um, Jonathan Rodriguez. Baseball player? Yes, baseball player. It's not very good, but uh, I played t-ball once. I didn't make the team, actually, I got cut. But, uh, when you get cut from t-ball, that's when you know that's not going to be your major profession when you grow up. So, uh, you know, you make a living. All right. 1970s called the Monster Breaks Back.